Hey, it's Mr. Bass. My Dark Horse Tackle box showed up today. This is the second one I've received, so I'm interested to see what's in it. A couple things about Dark Horse is they tend to focus on smaller, custom-made lures, handmade guys, small companies. They also are cheaper than a lot of other boxes. They only cost $25 per month, but... Uh, a lot of times uh, they only give you four to five lures for that. So you may not be getting a financial deal on any of the pricing, but I think their shtick is you'll get some unique stuff. They also have a single box, a single lure plan. So if you don't want to pay 25 a month, you can just ask for one lure a month and they send that to you. And I think it's like seven bucks or something like that. All right, this is like a little information card. It's not a sticker, but it says, as always, every bait in this box is crafted in America by the best small businesses the United States has to offer. So if you like that, this might be one of the reasons you subscribe to this box. So the first item in here is a soft plastic Ned rig bait by Bass Reaper Bait Company. And uh, these are just, you know, little, little uh, TRDs just like the Z-Man TRD um, they call it the blunt and this color is called pro blue purple flash comes in an eight pack uh, they say they're buoyant they float if you look at the design of this thing include it looks like they have just totally copied the Z-Man TRD down to the <laughs> down to everything it looks exactly like a Z-Man TRD. I don't know if there's something different about it or not. But I fish a lot of TRDs, man, and I can't tell the difference. In fact, I got a TRD right here. Let's put them side by side. I guess they're a little different. Uh, the TRD has the dots on it, but they're not as prominent as the dots on the blunt. And the blunt looks like it might be a little fatter. So anyway, that is the Blunt. One interesting thing that they're saying on their website about the Blunt is that guys on the elites are cashing checks with the Blunt. They don't tell you who though. So don't know much about Reaper Bates Company. It looks like they're a company out of Wisconsin and that there's a handful of guys that are tournament fishermen that basically design the baits and run the company. The next bait is by a company called Combat Lures. And this is a veteran-owned business that just started this year in 2021. And it looks like they just paint hard baits. I don't think they make hard baits, but I think they, they paint them. So this is a lipless that they included in the box this month. Uh, I don't know what they call this color. They call this crankbait the DHT Rambutan Shad it's a uh, white with uh, kind of red pinkish accents red eyes and a little bit of yellow along the lateral line it has a very loud knocker it's uh, probably about a half ounce bait uh, it looks like they have a fairly active Facebook page and it looks like if you have something you want painted, you can contact them, send them the blank, and they will paint it for you however you want. So, looks like he is a lure artist, Combat Lures. Next is a square bill by a company called Huey's Tackle Company. I can't find them on Facebook or on the web. Doesn't mean they're not around. I just couldn't find them. And he has a phone number here where he basically says, I'll make any lure you want. Just give me a call. Square bill, little purple back, kind of brownish gold scales, black lateral line. And then it kind of lightens up to white on the belly. Nice rattle. His colors are color, you know, looks like, Really good detail. 
Very nice looking crankbait. So that's another guy that you could uh, contact if you've got lures that you'd like to get custom painted. And as he says here, catch more fish on any lake with Huey's Tackle Custom Lures. And sometimes having a custom color really does make the difference. Next is a 3 8 ounce Signature Spinner Bait by Jig Masters. The color is Chartreuse Baitfish. And you may ask, who is Jig Masters? Uh, they're also a custom company. Our mission is to design, produce, and sell custom designed high performance bass fishing lures to help anglers of all levels catch monster bass all across the nation. The owner is named Cody Jennings. Looks like they make, uh, I'm just looking at their website, flipping jigs, football jigs, uh, spinner baits, uh, underspins. Terminal tackle, uh, marabou jigs, uh, and some soft plastics. So the double willow leaf uh, blade is uh, their signature spinner bait. It uses premium plated blades, and they run larger blades than most competitors. To do this, we had to develop a head design to help prevent rolling. This also features a custom line tie that gives you more ease of tying compared to an R-bend, which also, while also not allowing the line to slip down the shaft as well. Stainless steel ball bearing swivel. It also has a screw lock bait keeper for your trailer. Don't know if I care about that or not to tell you the truth. Here's what the custom head design looks like that they say keeps it from rolling over. Looks like a pretty decent spinner bait. So that's it this month, just four lures. What do you think of the box? I'd really like to know. Now here's another thing that I wanna to try to do. I'm gonna start doing with some of my unboxings. I would like to know which lure you would like to see me try to go catch fish on. So let me show you them real quick again. You've got the blunt Ned Rig bait. You've got the lipless by Combat Lures. You've got the square bill by Huey's Tackle. And you got the spinner bait. Which of those four lures would you like to see me fish with on a video? Let me know in the comments which one interests you the most and whichever one I get the most, most votes for. That's what I'll go and fish with. Hope this was helpful and informative. Hope you enjoyed it. If so, please hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, and share the video. It would greatly be appreciated. Until next time, this is Mr. Bass. Happy fishing!